principal sir and august house assalamu alaikum and very good day to all of you i welcome you all in this mustafa auditorium to witness the second stretch competition for the year that is the inda house english extempore speech competition for the year 2015 extempore is an art of excellent public speaking with a limited time for preparation and an extempore speech is an english is a bit tough challenge for the native speakers but our cadets had managed to show excellence in this competition over time now the rules and regulations of the competitions are each participant will get 4 minutes for the preparation while speaking at first a warning bell will be given at 3 minute and the final bell will be given at 4 minute while selecting the topic the participant shall have two choices he can choose the second topic over the first one but he is forbidden to come back to the first choice The total mark distribution of the competition is 50. Subject comprehend 15, description 15, pronunciation and expression of speaking 10, presentation 10. Now today's competitions, today's competitors are from Fosulog House, Kate Sajid 2804, Kate Mohammed 2703, Kate Nafis 2610, Kate Amir 2530. Now, without making any delay, I would like to request the first competitor, Kair Tanjim, to go and select his topic.
Now he will be given four minutes to take his preparation and I request the audience to have patience for the following four minutes. I request Kat Danjim to go and deliver his speech and at the same time I request our next competitor to go and choose his topic. I thought it could be my younger sister. Then I thought, no, it's not my younger sister. She's so small. 
Then I thought it would be my father. Then I remember that my father is at office. So who could that person be? Then I just remember it was my mother. And the panel of judges and the August Hospitals were here. Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning, morning to all of you. Today the topic selected for my next speech is nothing but my favorite person. Now what do you mean by your favorite person? Your favorite person means When uh, you have entered the competition, for example, I'm here in the system for speech competition. I got inspiration from my favorite person that you are going to go to your system for speech competition and will be able to do something in this competition. Again, if you have anything sadness, if you have anything happiness of happiness, if, you have, if anything you have of soreness, you can express the feelings, you can share the feelings with your favorite person. My dear audience, that's what you mean by your favorite person. And my favorite person is no one but my mother. My mother is the one who gave me birth, for which I am able to come to the system for speech competition in this piece of most of our culture. And I am talking in front of you and delivering my speech. The only reason for this is my mother. Her gentle life and soft voice makes me feel really happy. He cooks food for me every day, but now since I am in Cat College, I just feel a little bit of bad that I have left my favorite person. But still, when I get any parents' day, when I get any vacation, I always feel that tomorrow I will going to meet my favorite person. And when it is late, I just feel that someday, at least someday, I will meet my favorite person. And I will be very, very happy. And that will be the happiest moment of my life. When I will meet my favorite person, gossip with him or her, chat with him, and so on. Now, my favorite person is my mother, as I said. He always, she always takes care of me. Whatever I want, she just tells me that, what do you want? And I tell to her that I want this, but she tells, okay, I will give you, but wait, wait. But I know that this is for a, a, a particular type of specialty. She takes care of me very, very much. And now, as I said, I have come to the cat college, so I feel very, very bad that my parents have left me, and so on. When I went to cat college, when I first came to cat college, as a mother pair, she, I just cried too much, I just cried too much. My mom also cried, but when he went away, he was looking back, he didn't even look at me. Why was she looking? Why was she looking front? Why was not she looking to me? Then I just figured it out that maybe because she was hiding his tears, she was hiding her tears and not allowing me to see her tears and so on. But she said to me when, he, when I left her, she just said that I am leaving to the cat college for what? For your betterment, for your this, for your that, for making you a manpower, for making you a very, very good person, for making you something that will exist to the country and make the country prosper. That's why I have given you, I have given you the opportunity to get a chance in Cat College. I have uh, taught you so many things so that you can get a chance in Cat College. Then I said, okay mom, I have, you have completed all of my wish, all of my desire. Now it's my duty to uh, achieve my goal and uh, finish your desire. And I will try to complete my desire as much as I want. Now, as I said, that my favorite person is my mother. She is very, very, a, a very, very gentle person. Her gentle eyes and soft voice makes me feel very happy. You know what? My favorite flower is also rose. When I go to the rose and see the smell of the rose, I just feel that my mother is beside me. And this is how I remember my mother. Now, I remember my mother is very, very, very much. If I would get a shock, if I would get something in the system of competition, I'll just go to my mother and see that, look, boy, you have. God achieved this. I have achieved this prize. And with this, I conclude my speech hereby. Thank you. Thank you all. I request Kat Rakin to go and deliver his speech.
It was not many days ago. One day, I was kept admitted in a new school. Then, I sat beside a person who helped me so much. I still miss him. Do you know who that person was? That person was no other than my best friend. Honorable Acting Principal Sir, respected teachers, and Lord Jesus. Topic sacred for me, by luck, is not other than my best friend. My best friend is a be very beautiful and very honorable person. He is now standing in a very high standard. I will have to talk about this later, but at first I like to tell you something about a best friend. A best friend is he who performs his duty of another friend. A best friend. Audience, let me ask you an honest question. Truly, how many of you have a dream? Well, since this is not an interactive speech and I am the speaker alone, and I can't get your answer, so let me just share my opinion. You see, when I was very small, in front of my house, there was a field and I used to go out and play there. As I grew older, the trees were cut down, the grass was destroyed, and a building was made there. No matter, when I got a little older, as I used to go to my village, I used to play there. <coughs> but nowadays, even if I go to my village, I see that the trees are there being cut down, the huts and the mud houses are being destroyed, apartments are being built, and even industries are being built, and my dream of a beautiful Bangladesh is being destroyed. Most esteemed acting principles are learned panel of judges and August Valley will continue to sell more than a great dream to you. Today, the topic that my life is favorite for me in this Interhouse English Extempo Speech Competition is Greenhouse Effect. First, let me define to you what is Greenhouse Effect. You see, first, a greenhouse is a house that is made for preserving nature where there is a climate that is not suitable for it. You see, especially in very cold countries, a glass dome is made in which vegetation can be grown because when light enters with a specific wavelength, it is very strong and it enters. But after being absorbed, the heat cannot get out as the wavelength of radiation is less. So inside that greenhouse, there is a warm and artificial place, an artificial environment for growing trees. But you see, in our modern world, we the humans, for our ignorance, are destroying our ozone layer and make, like, making a fake greenhouse in this world through the atmosphere and we are baking ourselves. You see, the main cause of greenhouse effect is the chlorofluorocarbon gas and emission of excess carbon dioxide. When we are making industries, when we are using motor cars, when we are burning fuel, especially fossil fuel, we are making carbon emission gases which go into the atmosphere and break the ozone layer. And you see, as this ozone layer is broken, the ozone layer turns into oxygen and gaps are created in the ozone layer which cannot protect us from the UV radiations of the sun anymore. So when these rays are entering and heating our place, well, the temperature and the climate, temperature is increasing and the climate of the earth is changing. So you see, when the climate changes, it becomes very continental and it's hard for us to survive. The summer days are getting way hotter and the winter days are getting way cooler. We, the rich people, might be living a posh life. We're living under the roof of a building, concrete roof, where we do not get the sun's heat. And we might be wearing warm clothes when it's winter time. We might be having a hot cup of coffee in the morning. But those poor people out there, we are driving cars. They are not, but they are suffering and we are not. Why why is this? You see, there are ways to prevent it, and we cannot do it as we are ignorant of our own mistakes. We are blind to the world because what we are doing is for our posh life. But what is happening is because of us, and we turn a blind eye to it. Everywhere I see posters of stop carbon emissions, stop global warming, do this, do that. Which of you took one second look at those posters? I am damn sure none of you have even looked at them for a second time because you know what? It might be happening to the poor person standing in front of your house. It might be happening to the poor person who's begging out there in front of your car in the traffic jam. But when it's not happening to you, you just don't care. And that's what you need to change. Well, the thing is, to stop global warming, we just don't need to motivate myself or I just don't need to motivate you. We need to motivate a generation. A generation that will change this world, that will change this world into a better place, into a world it can be, into a world it should be. The world Mother Earth should be and the world Mother Earth was meant to be. You see, we were born in a green earth that we are destroying and painting red. And you see, like the uh, planets that are next to us, Venus, that's too hot, or Mars, that is absolutely no vegetation. The earth is next in line, dear audience, because 
unless we find a new earth and unless we change our mind, we are going to destroy the world and the cause is ourselves. So with the hope of motivating not only you, not only me, but the generation and stopping this madness, I would like to conclude my speech here. Thank you. Thank you all. Not possible in our college because we are very much and we are having very much boring life in, in these cat colleges. Every day PT, games, law, prep, so much uh, we are very much bored with this. But if we just try to uh, fling fr from college for one day or for two days, that will be very much special for us. Yes, I'm talking about a, an excursion to host in by acting principal sir, learned uh, band of judges and my dear cat brothers. Assalamu alaikum and a very good day to you all. Here in this section of this conversation, I have two and and yeah, I, my, my best discussion tour of my life was in last night. I went in, went in free in that time and it was the most, most exciting, exciting place I have ever visited because I was with my soulmates, I, I was with my 50 friends, I was with those, those of all. The things we have learned from that place is not special but we have enjoyed that, that this is special because we are very much, uh, very much in tight discipline, uh, in tight schedule in these care colleges. But if we can do anything special in, in any one day or two days, that will be very much special and that will be very much memorable day in, in our life. As, as their uh, discussion is very much favorite uh, for the carriers and whole, whole year is carriers waiting for that, that discussion. And before the discussion night, we have we had a little preparation because we had to wear, uh, we have to show our our dress up, our uh, respect, self respect, and our uh, carrot like attitude to them. Yeah, we are where we are going to going to show it, and we have to show a great attitude. So we have to uh, at first put our uh, put our dress clean and uh, tidy, and we have to just uh, wear a uh, wear a great dress to, to uh, visit that place. And we have just uh, direction from our former masters and our other teachers, and they help they help us in a lot of way for for enjoying the discussion. I I like to thank our former master for uh, for that kind of invitation and that kind of that kind of uh, things doing for the discussion. And I would like to say say to my care brothers who were just thinking for me about about that discussion. And in in last night in brief we went to the. When to see the how how rice are produced and how how many technologies we can use how many how technologies are uh, growing upward. Bangladesh is still a poor country or a developing country, but we have the great things to to be recovered. That we have some some much mechanic mechanics and some machines for uh, for our agricultural side. We have a description at first in the in the auditorium of free. We had seen that many uh, the ways of developing our agricultural side, the ways of developing our uh, our agricultural side by, by that. After that, we have some missionaries, missionaries in the we have seen many missionaries and which is used in the airport for for the agriculture. We have seen those kind of things. Those uh, echoes me in my heart that I will be one time a scientist and help my agriculture to be very much. Uh, very much useful for the country. If we just uh, think about the population in, is increasing so much day by day, but we have to think about that because we have to uh, provide that kind of food food to the people of people of our country. So we have to just think about it and just we have to uh, we have to provide those kind of useful missionaries through it. Through it, we can just help help ourselves help ourselves for, for the better country, better upgraded country. I just want my country, a great country. And that discussion, my one day discussion in last night, then he helped to uh, learn me, he to learn me that uh, one day I will become the, become the very much uh, the aggressive, very much good people of our nation and I will just help my agricultural side. And that's why I, I just like to use my, use my, uh, my brain to have that, those things. And after, it was the most exciting time when we were in the bus. We enjoyed a lot with my classmates. We have many pictures, pictures from my former staff. We have we collected them and uh, uploaded in the Facebook Facebook account. And they they got very much uh, very much popularity in, in ourselves. And if we just think about that day, this is exceptional and it's special for us because we are not in that college. That's special. And I hope that that college authority will permit us for uh, two discussion in a year. With this, so by the way, thank you, thank you.
we can accept him as your best friend. But remember, there is a problem of your room. Perhaps you have seen it or took knowledge from the image historic book. There is a problem that a friend is the a friend indeed. He may be the friend chosen from any level of life. This type of they say as well, I am working in Karen College. Here may be my best friend. Not only childhood friend will be the best friend. You know that many of childhood friends have cash talk from her boyhood to when you go to the upper level of education. Many of you cash talk. And helpful man is always a best friend for everybody. And helpful man always available for everybody. Do you know it? Anyway, the your uh, talking all the time was uh, uh, I think acceptable and it was a good presentation for them. Though there is sometimes interruption, there was sometimes uh, making long. Despite this, it was a good presentation. The third one, Mohani, Hotuloko, Eid Day. It is a most celebrated day for the Muslim and favorite day. People enjoyed this day. There are two festival Muslim Eid Day. One is Idul Adha and another is Idul Fitr. This two days, even the poor men who could not earn a a meagre amount in his livelihood earning. Also, on that day, she enjoyed with full, bigger, full refreshment. He purchased meal, samai, and other things within his family member. He enjoyed it. Your uh, benevolence on, on this eat day was good and I think very much precise and clear to everyone. Thank you for your good. Presentation of this intake. Next, Khaim. Khaim about ICT. Faith. His presentation at the outset initially was good, but at the last it was uh, very much disturbing. I should say it was very much marked. And the whole deliberation has been marked when at the last time he delivered his speech. Despite this, you avoid it for future development of your extraterrestrial speech. Next, Rakib Bilesh Piyad. It is also uh, one thing remember, extraterrestrial speech I tell you that it should be totally actionable, not depending on script writing. And time and again do not see the script. This will mark, this will make murky the way of good expression of your actionable speech. So, uh, try to avoid it and uh, uh, despite this, it was a good to be for all of us. Next, Haji, my college hospital. He told about college hospital. He also depended on skip writing. Yes, you can skip, but all the time you cannot use the skip in the before the audience. Um, you should try to in future mostly on skip writing like the others, you say extemporary. Now, come to the senior cadets. <coughs> Dhamma is to be the lottery of Forty Lakhs. He has a noble vision to do something for the mankind, for the college hospital, for the development of Bangladesh. It is also a good uh, thinking, I think. He is thinking maybe uh, full bit in the future. <laughs> Next, um, and he will also spend a lot of money for Padda Bridge. It is his novel idea. Next, Tauzin. 
No veo los ojos. What is duty to the nation? He has, he has made example that many of our candidates are now have a good position in the hierarchy of the country, like government of Bangladesh Bank, ex, uh, even the candidates are uh, working in NASA and something like that. But uh, he has that uh, candidates duty to the nation. He has also the hope that all the candidates will look, do like this way in future. I believe and hope that his hope will be fulfilled in the future. <laughs> Next, Asha. International Mother Language Day. He has some reservation about English speaking. Why? Though if the Chinese, Korean or Japanese can develop in their own language, why even in the international mother language we use English? He showed that 200 years we are under the British rule, so that we accept this English. But I do not include the international mother day, it is my mother tongue. But you should know, remember it, the Japanese, the Korean, the Chinese, they have Learn language, technical knowledge, everything from the English manuscript and make it work in, in their own language, Japanese language. We should do also the same thing for develop our national, national scientific, agricultural, and the IRP. So, in terms of Mother Day, Mother Day is observed now, every, even that, uh, you know, you know, so Mother Day, we have the respect to it and we think that it is the importance of it will extend day by day in the future. We hope so. Dawa, parents did, he told that the parents are coming here with delicious food and then after so many difficulties, they love the sun, they are warm very much. So they were, it is, he uh, speaks also very good, it was precise and uh, with logic. Afrin Saradi House, he at the beginning had a halt, had a pause or respite, which normally we do not, uh, we do not expect it from him. So make it uh, correct in future and make the uh, extraordinary excuse laudable or acceptable to everybody. And his topic was greenhouse effect. This is also, he told many, he shows, wanted to show the argument in favor of the what of the green, greenhouse effect. And he expected that this, uh, uh, all the debris will be removed and the, our whole world will be habitable. I hope that, we will also hope to be so that what he is saying about green house effect. Last, but not least, Nafis. He uh, topic was one day excursion. He showed that this, by this excursion, he earned many knowledge from agricultural equipment, fire is away, master showing, many machine tools. I think his, this thinking would be fulfilled if he nourish it time and again and do accordingly. With this, I will uh, conclude my review and hope to best and good future. And we are proud you. Thank you, thank you all. Thank you, sir. We hope Kersi will be encouraged by your speech to do better on the next performance.
Now, the most awaited result is in my hand now, but before declaring the result, I would like to request our Honorable Prince, Acting Principal Sir to come over here and distribute the prizes. Sir, please. And at the same time, I would like to request our CSC OIC Mr. Mohammad Rashid Jai Manu to come over here and, and kindly assist him. Sir, please. At first, individual prizes. Engineer group, second position goes to cat number 2741 cat First question holder is 2703 Kedmohamed. <laughs> The first question primarily achieved by cat number 2554 cat Afrin and cat number 2549 cat Zaman. Now is the time for overall result. According block point 40.5, runner up goes house goes to Nuzul House. And the champion house is Sonati House. Now I would like to request our acting principal sir to come over here and say something on today's cooperation. Sir, please. My learned colleagues and my dear cadets. Assalamu alaikum. And a very good morrow. To all of you. Dear cadets, a few, few minutes back, the competition, inter house English extended competition, is completed. First of all, I like to thank Mr. Joyrul Islam to review this competition nicely. Dear cadets, you know Mr. Zahir is leaving us very soon. 
after a couple of days he is going on retirement so personally i selected his name for reviewer of this competition just to give a scope to say something to deliver a speech before him and he has done it nicely so i again i again thank you now dear cadets this is a except for competition except for means you know what do you have to say on the spot for this competition there is no script there is no syllabus or topics previously given so i think this is a hard competition and absolutely this competition depends on the individual performance skill knowledge of the cadet performer cadet i think and i i think all of my colleagues will agree with me this competition owes an excellent competition where all the performers all the participant cadets cadets they have done well i can i can say i can mention some of the good side of the competition what i observed personally yes throughout this competition junior and senior no cadet or there is no fumbling or spluttering with the participant cadets more or less almost all cadets they were very fluent in their presentation so i think i am very happy to see this performance of the cadet at the same time i will hope the cadets will have their practice in speaking in english everywhere in all environment i am very sorry to say cadets do not speak in english when they are, they remain in the dormitory or they are in the classroom among them if you have that practice in speaking in english it will help you to face any situation or to deliver anything before anybody is in in, in everywhere so my dear cadets please have this practice to speak in english it will give you confidence when you will have the fluency it will give you the confidence and confidence will make you knowledgeable so please have this practice without any hesitation if you hesitate then it will spoil it. you are the learner so if you have i think you will have no hesitation to learn to do have any practice so please have this practice everywhere however my dear cadets this competition was a good competition i am very happy in next time again we will be waiting to see the better performance in other competition which are there in future in this stage <coughs> i also believe our cadets you have that ordinance to prove yourself as a potential as a qualified cadets i like to see the cadets qualified cadets potential cadets talented cadets in mirzapur cadet college who will be unparalleled to the or who will be the example to the cadets of other cadet college so with this so today i like to conclude 
having this faith our credits you will be most docile to love and to deliver something nicely before all of us okay thank you very much thank you Thank you sir for your valuable speech. I hope guests will be highly impressed by your speech.